Mmm, coffee. <laughs> I seriously am constantly drinking coffee, especially when making these videos. So I thought I would make a coffee video just for you guys. Let's get started. <music> So this is my coffee attic candle. I make this with soy wax, so I guess it's a soy latte. I don't know. I'll be honest, I drink coffee like constantly, <laughs> obviously. So anyway, here's what you'll need. Soy wax, a container, a wick, and you're gonna need plenty of coffee. Obviously when I show you guys the wax, you need more wax than what I show you. I'm just showing you what I use. So anyway, I got some whole beans. And then in the other bag, I have some uh, already ground coffee. You're gonna need a little bit of both. Uh, like you can actually see in that bag. I know, it's terrible. Anyway, <laughs> so the first thing is put your wick in. You can dip it in wax if you want. Um, I think I did. Or you can just layer beans over it like I did here and then pour in some wax. Now here's where I went wrong. Please don't do this. Let your wax harden all the way because I got too anxious and poured in more wax before the bottom was super settled. I wanted the beans to stay at the bottom because they will burn when the candle wax or when the flame hits them and it'll smell gross. So I wanted to keep the beans at the bottom. <laughs> so I put in some more ground coffee on top before it hardened and then didn't let it sit long enough. But so my idea with this candle is I wanted the ground coffee all throughout. I didn't want to do layers, which would have been much easier. So my basic technique was to pour in coffee as I was pouring in wax. If that makes sense. So here's where the bottom broke and the beans floated up. I did end up scooping out a bunch of the beans off the top um, at the end of the video, but I forgot to show it. You can see some beans still are up there. Ugh. Uh put your wick into something to hold it in place so that when your candle settles it'll be in the middle this is a wick bar again as always i will post everything in the description of where you can find it and let your candle set super exciting and there you go super easy coffee candle i did not include scents but i think vanilla might sound smell really good just a little light vanilla scent um, or cinnamon like coffee with cinnamon in it. You could do the foaming technique we did before and put some wax on it. Anyway, if you enjoyed this, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and I will see you soon. Peace.